Hello, cozy friends. We are back with another cozy demo. Cozy demo episode three. And I'm really excited about this one because I've been talking about Garden Story for a minute now. Really excited to try it. Let's get into it, okay? Let's get into it. Start a new game. All right, I'm excited. In our beginning, there was the grove. Oh, I need to click, okay. Oh, so pretty. Timeless, supernatural, and sentient. It is the foundation of our home and the source of our existence. A tree so large and overflowing with mana it spilled over, populating its foundation with our peoples. That time has ended. The grove is now silent. Malevolent, oozing rot has seeped in, seeking to separate us from our greatest protector. Many heeded the rot's challenge, rallying the grove to a time of bravery and action. Each guardian exploring a new horizon of life's many possibilities. More stepped up for the community for the first time we truly grew. To most, it was their first time fighting. The meek foraged in their spirits in combat. When the island grew weaker, their desperation and hubris spelled demise for all but two. The heroes of our world forever lost, chasing the final horizon behind our island. Beyond our island. The grove ever mourning wants for a new guardian to lead them. In a new age of turmoil, fate focuses on Concord, the youngest of Spring Hamlet. A quiet gardener of few words and fewer aspirations. Me. Me AF. <laughs> Move around for a bit. Roll, run. Roll or run. <gasps> Cute. Check the kindergarten vine. Interact with the vine. What vine? What are you talking about? What vine? Not me getting mad. What, is this the vine? Oh, this. Okay. Okay. Can, the leaves are a little wilted. They could use some dew. It looks like a fiddle leaf fig. Okay, some dew. What do I, how do I do that? Okay. Oh, I gotta go to my garden. Oh, you go inside. Oh, it's so cute. What's this? Inside lies Concord's rucksack in an empty jar. Take them? Yeah. The tool shed is now empty. Obtain your working tools. Search the tool shed. Equip the jar for use. Okay. Okay, equip. Obtain some morning dew at the well. Okay. Um, hello? Yay! Okay, use item with S. Interesting. Yay! So cute! Interact with the vine one more time. Uh, enchanted by dew, it doesn't look nearly as wilted before, yet it still refuses to grow. Oh, Concord, you busy right now? Oh, Plum is so cute! Come say hi to good old Plum. Okay, I'm coming! Do I have to walk through the garden? I guess so. That's fine. Evening, Concord. Looks like you've been working hard. You toil so much for a vine that refuses to grow. Oh, jeez. Have you been locked up there this whole time? Let me get this gate open for you. I'm really sorry about that. Nothing here works like it used to. Not since we lost Alio. Oh, yeah, Alio. My work is good and honest, yet even with all the effort, it seems like the grove is still slipping away. At least I can come back here to you for a breath of fresh air. You never asked me for anything. Sorry for getting here so late. Got caught up with some trouble in Bell Row. I'm gonna make it up to you though. I've got a gift for you. Granny Smith just completed it and it's ready for pickup in the Hamlet. I know you don't usually travel outside the kindergarten so take this map. Don't want you to get lost, hee <laughs> hee. Spring Hamlet is just southeast, right through the riverways. Riverways, riverways, riverways. I labeled them on the map already but you have the pleasure of charting the rest of the grove. Map get. Map get. <laughs> Map get. Map get. I get it. I get it. it. I get it. The map. Okay. Okay. Head to the wood forge in the hamlet. I don't know what that means. I'm just going to go this way. And hope for the best. I'm hoping for the best. Isn't that what we're all doing at all times? Rana, whoa, Concord. Getting bored of watering plants all day? Never too late to join the rest of us in the hamlet. If you ask me, we have enough green lands already. I think we could use more frogs in the grove. Do us all some good. 
Good to see you stepping out of the kindergarten. Finally, in your rebellious phase. Okay, everybody's giving me a hard time. What, what if I? What if I don't like to change my routine? What if new things scare me? Leave me alone. Don't worry. I won't tell Guardian Plum you're sneaking out. Might want to be careful. I saw him around. Anyways, it's getting late and the rot's starting to pop up. You know how they get once the sun gets set. Don't want to see a tiny gardener fighting rot with their bare hands. That'd be pathetic. Ha 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 ha. Shut up. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Oh, I'm just joking. Okay. What is this? Read sign. Spring Hamlet's abundant waters polish our underwater sediment every day. Okay. I just need to know where the wood forge is. Do I have to get back at a certain time? Over here, Concord. I hope you like it. I'm coming. Hum she, the rot is stirring in new ways. I can hear rumbling in the pits of the library. There it goes again. Will I ever feel safe again? I don't know. I don't know. Go on. What am I getting? What am I getting? I'm going in here? Oh, hi. Granny Smith is so cute. Sweet little Concord, come to bless my little shop. Plum told me you'd be visiting here. Paid me a pretty nice price to make this for you. Oh, that's nice. Everyone's talking a lot about the grove's condition, and we're all worried about you. Ron has been talking about getting you out of the kindergarten. You're all alone there. These rot are spelling dangerous times, eh? And a tender grape could use the protection. Still, it's a lot for Guardian Plum to be equipping the youngest of the hamlet with a weapon. There have been a lot of mix-up. Villagers have been moved around everywhere to accommodate the encroaching rot. Even now, it's hard for any of us to catch a break. Too much rot everywhere, right? If the vine refuses to produce more greenlings, you may very well remain the youngest of us. You should come by more often. We barely see you, Conquer. Tums Tumshi could use a comforting friend. Plus, a dedicated gardener like you will have to have need for a spade later, just like Plum. And if you ever get tired of gardening, we have no shortage of other work to be done. That was a lot of talk. Pick get. Pick get. I get it the pick. Gather items from the environment by whacking them. Okay. What's this? I have no money. Okay. Now what? Head back to kindergarten. Oh, trust me. I will. They made me pay extra to make it for you. Even a harvesting tool like the pick carries the connotation of battle now. I think it worries some to know that a secluded grape like you is readying for combat. Let's head back to the kindergarten before it gets too late. But try out your new pick just in case you run into something. Well, I'm ready to fight. They're talking about all the all this rot. And be careful. I'm ready. I'm ready. All right, Concord. You have your pick, but I want you to use it now. It may be good for gathering, but I, wa but I want you to be able to, to defend yourself. Please, Concord, squash these rot. I'll keep you from getting too hurt. Just show me what you got. Don't worry. This feels like... I know he's trying to, like... Slowly introduce me, but he really put me in the thick of oh shit in the thick of danger. How did he spring back up? I killed him. Uh oh, nasty things, aren't they? Under moonlight, they grow more resistant to our force. Greenlings may be born up from the sun, but rot prefer the cover of night. Watch your step. I don't want you to get stuck in their goop. Are you okay? It was kind of fun. I liked it. You did really well, I'm proud of you. They say the pick was the first tool Hamlet villagers used to fight. Seems fitting for you, gardener. I know you're not used to combat, so if you have any scuffs, might want to pull out your jar. It's a good idea to always be using dew. It's for much more than just tending the kindergarten vine. Just one drop is all you need to make at least some of your wounds disappear. Whoa, Plum is giving out weapons? I want one too. Gotta tell everyone, Plum is cool now. It's not like that. Rana, get out of here, you already have a pick. Conquered. Let's head back to the kindergarten before we get sidetracked. I don't want more rot to pop up. Okay, but let me get my little materials, please. Yay. Fun. How do I use my do? <gasps> oh, I used it on myself. That's so cute. Hmm. Plum seems a bit more touchy than usual. Keep an eye on them for me, okay, Concord? You know, I think you're doing great, Concord. I know you're still new to the grove, and the villagers may baby you a bit much, but I know they all look up to you in their own special way. Your new pick should mostly be used for gathering, but there will be times of danger. The rot may not always carry ill intent, but the damage they do is real. Since Cain picked me up as a guardian, resisting them is all I've, I've really known. With what little you know of the guardians, how do you feel about them? 
Worn out relics. I really have no idea. Sorry. Ah, that's okay. Sorry, perhaps I asked too much of a greenling so fresh. You barely ventured outside the kindergarten, much less Hamlet. If you only had a glimpse of what the entire grove had to offer. I've talked to Alderberry. We've decided... We've decided move you out of the kindergarten. We've decided move you out of the kindergarten. You may have some concerns, but I think you need to be around others. Your role here may have been sacred, but the kindergarten vine is no longer producing greenlings. We're no longer needed here. That much I'm sure you've known for a while now. Tomorrow, pick up your things and meet me in the bend. It's high time you live as the rest of the Hamlet does, and I'm sure you'll come to enjoy it. Wait. But, but I like my little leaf. I like my little leaf. I have to leave? Say goodbye to the kindergarten, but I liked it here. It was nice. I had a little vine and a little knife. I don't know what the knife is for, but I had a knife and I liked it. Gonna get more dew. How much dew can I get? Only two dew. Walk to the bend. Goodbye. Goodbye, kindergarten. Goodbye, kindergarten. I don't know. Southwest. Never eat soggy. Okay, Southwest. This is my new home. Okay. Okay, I don't, okay. Here, Concord, thank you for coming. I know it's a big change of pace, but we've tried our hardest to make this a new home for you. It's a nice upgrade from that shack in the kindergarten, at least. I like my shack and my little leaf, I liked it. And a place like the Bend always has a nice flow of dew. Plum and I have a few more things to talk about. Rana, why don't you show them inside while we talk? You're with me. Take your time, we have a lot to talk about. Okay, I like the little, what is that, a radish or strawberry? Meet you inside. This is my home? <gasps> I have a whole entire home? Don't get too excited. This place was a total dump before we got it set up. But I'm sure it's still way fancier than that shack in the kindergarten. I liked my shack and I don't have a knife anymore. It's not a home without a pillow leaf to sleep on, of course. Oh, when you're done for the day, you can come here and rest your tired eyes. Or, you know... Do what I do and sit and sit and think about cool things all day. Food, you repaired this old, old well here for you to use. You're probably used to using one to keep the vine fresh, but you'll be using it on yourself after you get hurt. So make sure you have plenty on hand. If you collect any new clothes, you can change them out here. Clothes? But he's a little grape. He's a little grape. What clothes will fit on him? For when you want to look your best. We've got a box here for our village storage. You can deposit your harvest into any of these boxes to save them for our town. Gotta keep your backpack nice and free for more resources. That's pretty much everything we were able to haul here. Take a look around. But don't get too comfy just yet. Let's go round up with those geezers before you doze off. I'm sure Elderberry had a few more words. They always have a few more wor words. Okay, I'm just following directions. I'm, I'm a little grape and I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing besides following directions. Elderberry, feeling better about moving Concord? A few days more and I know this place will feel like home for you. When we first made this place, it was just for storage. Now our favorite sprout is living. Our favorite sprout? Me, little old me, thank you, oh my goodness. I'd really like for you to be more of an active part of the Hamlet. They really said, oh, you got social anxiety. We're gonna force you to not be socially anxious. Soon they'll need you for the coming days. I'm having Rana take you around tomorrow. I think a nice introduction to what daily life is like will be good for you. But for now, rest up in your new home. You look just a tad bit wilted, and I want you ready for the next day. And be careful for rot that may gather here. They've been catching villagers off guard at night. <gasps> Ooh, what if I want to talk to people? What if I don't want to sleep yet? I want to be a bad little grape. I don't want to sleep yet. Oh, who are you? Ah, oh, good day, eh, Greenling? Don't squander it. Sorry if you want to enter, but this corner belongs to the Autumn Town Runaways. Don't worry, we getting by just fine without you, bugger. The lot's real thankful for to you Hamlet people for giving us a new place to live, but it ain't our nature to depend on charity from softies like yourself. I don't know if that's the accent they were going for, but... Don't take it the wrong way. We, we'd just prefer to rely on the skills we brought from Autumn Town. Okay. I'm not taking anything the wrong way. I don't know what's going on. I That's fine. I'm just trying to thrive. I'm trying to vibe today. I got uprooted from my little leafy, leafy shack. It's a nice place, but I was used to my little shack. What's down here? Oh. Okay, fine. <laughs> I guess I'll sleep. Three requests. Okay, what now? No hat. 
Oh, you get hats. That's fun. Morning. Already up and at it, Concord? Yeah. You're looking chipper. Hope your new home is holding up. It was pretty nasty before Fuji worked it over. The truth is that the hamlet sorely needs all the help it can get. But now you're not cooped up in the kindergarten, so we can make use of you here. Lucky for you. Today I made some time to walk, walk you through it all. If you're working the hamlet, you'll want to keep your eye on this board here. The villagers have put up a few requests, and it's now your job to help them where you can. People always need a few things done here and there. Blah, blah, blah. Help Rana out. Blah, blah, blah. Rana, do something for once. It's fine if you ignore them, but if you want our village to grow, they'll need your help. But I want to make sure you uh, make a good, a good first impression. Who do I need to make an impression for? I'm just a great living life. I've been, I don't know why I need to make a good impression. I'm just living. Because, <gasps> you know, it'd make me look bad if you just laced. Why do I want to make you look bad? So no wiggling out of your duties today. We're going to hit all requests, no matter how long it takes us. Bedded roots have grown into Belltown. Cut them down before someone gets hurt. The bridge from Spring Hamlet to Riverway has deactivated. You can get there from the bend to reactivate them. Granny Smith has to re-sharpen the guard's tools and is asking for glass shards from the beach. We need four in a forge box. Okay. Well, where the hell did Rana go? Okay. Oh, whoops. I forgot. The bridge to Hamlet is down, but I guess we were bound to repair anyways. It was on the request board after all. Most of the structures in Hamlet are made from a special wood Granny Smith uses, but they're a bit finicky. Those glass nodes up there should control the bridge. Uh, I don't really know what all the lights mean. I just keep hitting those glass nodes up there and it works out in the end. So try whacking them a bit. I'm going to plan out our day. Oh. Nice. Oh, is it like a little puzzle? Interesting. Okay. Or I just have to click all of them on, maybe? I don't know what I did, but okay. Let's get this slimy boy. I like getting the slimy boys. Yeah. Ah, nice. Bridge up. Request done. Nothing like the smell of rivers in the morning. Careful! But sadly, we got things to do. Let's keep heading to Spring Hamlet. We should head out to the docks. <gasps> he got so close to that guy. Okay. I need to revive myself. Nice work, but our day is just beginning. Let's head south to the docks. We need to forward some stuff for Granny Smith. Okay. Okay, it makes sense now. Ah, the Hamlet Center of Trade. The docks have seen better days, but a lot still happens here. As for our next request, the Hamlet needs glass. Jars often wash up on the shore here, and while they're too damaged for holding dew, glass is still very valuable, especially in Spring Hamlet. Once you've gathered all the glass we need, put it in this bin here. Gotta put them in the labeled bin since things kind of get lost in the village storage. Is this, what is this? Oh, that's the glass I'm getting? I put them in this box? Oh. Okay, I did it, I did it. This request is in the bag. We do good work together, Concord. Too bad it still work. Amen. Amen, brother. There's some commotion in Bell Row, so let's head eastward. It's a bit of a walk, but I'm sure we can get there before sunfall. Don't want to stay out too late. The rot might eat you whole. Hee hee hee. That's so funny. Being eaten whole is so quirky, goofy, funny. I love you. Hello, Maraschino. Hi, Maraschino. Beat it, Rana. I'm busy. Busy with work. Not that you'd understand. Oh ho ho, a little sour today. For the record, showing Concord around is my solemn and sacred duty. Concord and I are heading to fight Rot and Bell Row, but I bet you're so jealous. Ugh, just go already. If we're lucky, your dishonorable attitude won't rub off on Concord. Ah, ha ha ha, let's go, Concord. Maraschino's busy watching the shore. What a snore. Someone's gotta lighten up. The summer bar's not going anywhere, you know. What's the summer bar? What's the summer bar? Huh? Huh? What's that? What's that? What's the summer bar? This way, Concord. Bell Row is just north of here. Okay. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, hey, Fuji. Fuji. Fuji here, Fuji. Hello. Staying out of trouble. Whoops. Oh, yeah, totally. You know, I'm actually help helping Concord out right now. Responsible things. Sure. 
Anyways, Granny Smith is sending me to the summer bar. Don't know when I'll be back. The sea folk always need help. Who knows how long their town will last. Say hi to Lily Pup for me. Hate that place. <laughs> Let's roll Concord before even more rot starts popping up. But I like the rot. I want it to pop up. I want it to pop up. It gives me money. Am I not supposed to get it out of these things? Are they there for safety purposes? Because I like it. What's this? The lilies have grown too weak to walk on. Oh. Ooh, that was a lot of running. I'm absolutely blasted. You mind taking this last one, Concord? Tending to the kindergarten as a pacifist your entire life must have been hard. I bet you're just itching to bring the pain. Well, I won't stop you. These rot roots we need to clear out can be a little tricky, though, which is why I got you a shield. That and because I'm very helpful in general. Some of the rot disperse these nasty spores that seek out innocent bystanders like us. You can't just smack these things down, which totally sucks. But any shield in the grove will prevent you prevent the spores from touching you. I got a shield. Hazel shield get. Hazel shield get. Use offhand. Oh, cool. What are these things? Concord, doing the rounds? Looks like you're doing well for yourself. I'm running some errands too. I'll check in with you later, okay? That's suspicious. Oh, I need a stronger tool for that, okay. Are they shooting shit? Oh. Yeah, suck on that. I gotta heal. Hi, who are you? Tarong, you're conquered, right? Nice to meet you. Sorry, but Winter Glade is closed off to others right now. If you ever need help, I'm here. Okay, that's fine. I didn't want to go there anyways. I didn't know where I was going. Let's talk to let's talk to Rana. Whew, that was a toughie. Well, you're still here, so I guess that means something. All the requests are done. Go team Rana. But I'm still beat, so I'm gonna take a hike back up to the bend to rest. Yeah, you're just leaving me here? What the heck? I mean, I'm just, you know, I'm busy. You can expect me to babysit you for the rest of my life. Oh, fine. I give in, but only because I'm extremely kind. I'll help you out more. Just don't expect me to overwork myself for you. But for real, I'm heading out. I think you can take care of yourself. The rest of Hamlet thinks you're a big baby, but I got your number, Guardian. Plum is still lingering around here. Might want to check in with them. Where's Plum? Plum, I'm all alone. Tell the Glade that I understand, but I need a bit more time to arrange everything here. It's not like Ladidi wants me there anyways. I'm sure the Hamlet needs you, but unless we can find the root of this... Oh, Concord, I didn't see you there. Listen, this is a private matter. I'll meet you by your new home later on today. There's a few more things I think we should talk about. Okay, but it's so far. No, it's closed off, I think. Me thinks it's closed off. <gasps> Maybe here. Yay! Oh no. Yeah, come here, little bitch. Oh, yay! Okay, this was not my home, but it was close. Right? I just had to go up, right? 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 I don't know, I'm lost. Okay, I'm just going off in instinct. Is this it? Yeah, we did it. Oh, he looks so tired. Mr. Plum, what's wrong? Concord. You probably noticed by now that things are a bit off. I haven't been entirely transparent about your transfer out of the garden. The truth is, the Hamlet won't have the resources to keep you out there in the kindergarten. Don't worry about the vine. I believe it will do just fine without you. Everything is nourished in, in Spring Hamlet. And once I'm in Winterglade, there will be no one to maintain those trails. Fuji's gone off to Summer Bar. We're cut off from Autumn Town. The work just keeps piling up. I don't know what any of this means. And on top of that... You're leaving us behind, aren't you? No, no, it's not like that, Concord. But there is truth to it, I suppose. Winterglade is asking for my help, and I know I'm needed there. But this won't be like other trips I've taken. <gasps> and it terrifies me. Are they not coming back? I've always loved the Hamlet. Always will, but I can't just ignore the rest of the grove. Every village lives in such quiet pain. All of us depend on strong people like you. That's why... I'm declaring you the official guardian of Spring Hamlet. <gasps> me, me, me? Don't get too nervous now. I know it's a lot, but every guardian started where you stand now. The grove is a magical place, but it's also unknown, sacred, in many ways scary. And your connection to it is the same. 
The grove came to the first guardian, Cain, and picked them. And then Cain picked others, like me, and Hop. By extension of that original choice, every guardian is chosen by the grove itself. Back then, I didn't understand Cain, but they refused to hear otherwise. Right now, I stand by my choice too. Here, I want you to take this journal and pay attention to the ways you grow. In due time, you'll come to learn what I've always known about you. You have the power to do so much more. You just need time to realize it. I don't have much more to say, but if you'd like, we can enjoy the sounds of the river. It would be nice to spend a few moments with you before I leave. Why is this making me emotional and I don't even really know Plum like that? Personal journal get right after that emotional moment. Okay. <gasps> oh, I'm just going to sit here with Plum. Okay. How was that? <gasps> I can sit like right next to him. Oh, Daddy Plum. This is nice, but you should probably sleep soon. You're going to have a lot on your plate soon. Okay. Bye, Daddy Plum. I'll probably never see you again. I I love you. Yay, yay. I like that this has daily tasks. That's fun. And so, a new one joins us on the greater plane of events. Welcome, young sprout. Within you, I sense many things. Juvenile doubt, longing, dreams of a future fraught with possibility and danger. The very same things that molded the other guardians. In time, you could be the champion I seek. For now, I pray for your success in things to come and safety. That is so cute. Um, I will end it there because I feel like that sets up the game pretty, pretty, um, pretty well. Uh, I'm invested in the storyline already. Let's just see what Rana, Rana says. Okay, everyone knows that I'm the goat. All of Plum's old duties are mine, but our hard work yesterday has already paid off. You've probably sensed it. The villagers will even deposit money into your mail whenever you help out. Oh my goodness. On top of that, the Hamlet's maintenance is on a whole nother level now stuff like that'll help out granny smith with making new stuff for our tools each shopkeep relies on a different part of the grove and you're going to be out there maintaining it for them as we build more the rock continues to threaten us we'll need you to help us with pushing the rock back we'll be putting up more requests for fighting and i hope we can count on you to face the challenge i know many are skeptical conquered i can already see you'll be a fine guardian this is just the start of your work i know there's many others outside the hamlet who need someone like you Dare I say, with that pick, you are sp the spitting image of a young plum. Oh yeah, sure, I mean the color's there, but if plum wanted a new guardian to help out, perhaps a brawnier person would literally carry more weight. Don't listen, Arana, you're strong and cool if I may add. I don't fully know what plum has in mind, but I know the grove couldn't have picked a better candidate. Yeah, 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 I'm kidding. A bit more experience and I bet you'll be able to kick my butt in two weeks. Oh, I will. Just remember to drink your dew, okay? Oh yeah. Congratulations, Guardian Concord. Don't blow it, okay? Okay, I will probably, because I don't know what I'm doing, but okay. This is really cute. So there's like a little bit of a puzzle element with the like um, node things. There's gathering, there's gathering, and then there's fighting. I wonder if there's going to be more... Um, growing or anything like maybe we'll get to use that this is very cute this is very cute i like the storyline i like the setup i like this freaking grape he's freaking adorable i would look at his face often i like all of the characters i like the difference in characters i'm already invested in the storyline and fighting the little things is fun y'all know i don't really like to fight that much and i like the i like fighting little guys so i like it Garden story, do I recommend? Yes, I do. It's cute. It's cozy. The music is fire. I mean, you can hear it, it's fire. I'm trying to think if I have any other thoughts. I think the map seems like it's probably large. Yeah, look how big it is. Yeah, it seems like there's a lot, a lot to the map, which is fun. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> I think it's kind of hard to just base off of this. I'm sure there's a lot more to it, like with all these little shops and da da da. Loving it, loving it. What do you think? What do y'all think? Do you, does it interest you? Do you want to get it? Um, but does it remind you of anything? It kind of reminds me of like older games a bit. And I like that about it. It's really cute. All right. Thank you for watching another episode of Cozy Demos. More to come. Let me know if there's any that you want me to try. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye. Love you. Stay cozy.